40 weeks and three days. That's where this pregnancy is at currently. Y'all, like, <laughs> I'm so tired. I am so ready to pop out this baby. It's not even funny. And I didn't think that I would be overdue like I was with my first because supposedly my body's done this before and you would have thought that I would have had him maybe even a little early, but no. 40 weeks and three days. So I'm getting ready to go in here and get some kind of test done. I don't know what it's called, a stress test for the baby where they hook you up to all this, these monitors, they put these, you know, readers on your belly to make sure the baby's not under any kind of stress to make sure that it's safe to wait until my induction date which is this coming July 3rd at 8 p.m. so he's coming you know regardless but today's the 30th so that's still three days away and I'm tired like I know I just sound like a complaining person right now but like the impatience level right now that I'm experiencing it's just off the chain. Like, I really wanted to just be holding my baby by now, you know? And so, wish me luck. I'm going to go on in here and do this test, and I will see you shortly. So much fun. Let's make a quick and easy tuna salad. I love elbow macaroni with any type of salad, whether it be chicken salad or tuna salad. I love it. And I also like a hard boiled egg, but I usually keep those to the side rather than mixing it in. Besides eggs and elbow macaroni, I'll also be using these ingredients. I only use two kinds of seasoning, black pepper and lemon pepper for the tuna meat. Be sure to stir that seasoning around that meat very nicely and evenly. Next, you're gonna be adding in that Miracle Whip and mustard. I'd be delicate with the mustard. You really will need more Miracle Whip than that. So you'll probably wanna just add it in as you go. Once you strain that macaroni, you can go ahead and dump that in with the mixture of tuna and Miracle Whip and mustard. Don't forget to add a little bit of onion, it adds a great flavor, and really you only need about two tablespoons of that diced up. Be sure to stir and mix together nice and evenly as well. You may need to add more Miracle Whip. And then you'll put it all in the refrigerator to cool for about a couple hours. Mmm, and don't forget to enjoy it. Okay, so my appointment went very well. Um, basically, had to do the little test that you saw, and um, they said everything's normal, so we're sticking with July 3rd as my induction date. Hopefully, fingers crossed, he'll come before then, but if not, yeah, that's what I'm looking forward to. So, only a few more days. I think I can take it. I have no choice, right? But at least I'm gonna have a nice, healthy, beautiful baby boy very soon. Um, thank you guys so much for watching, all your support. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.